Hello, I'm Geoffrey from Jeu Studio. I would like to show you a trick to simulate a kind of a realistic uh, flame and also talk to you about the um, fluid simulation in Unreal Engine 5 because I noticed something uh, pretty interesting. Look at this. Look on the screen here. See the stats? This is the fluid simulation. So it's a, the, the real one. And now, still, and here, the good old uh, 2D trick. See the stats? Difference is not, uh, it's not there in every um, situation. Here, as an example, the, the stats are exactly the same. Uh, or almost. So... I think sometimes it might be just interesting to simply do this and activate that. <laughs> then you just just use the um, just uh, Niagara system new system from a uh, template. Well, uh, choose this one. Then you can tweak it. I'll show you. Uh, I, I'll cancel uh, since I uh, have this one. It's a bit overwhelming at the beginning, but uh, nothing very crazy in the end. Things that are important might be uh, the density and dissipation. I do this. Look. See? Now, put it back. Depends if you want it to turn to smoke fast, basically. This kind of, uh, of stuff can be interesting. Just try to, to tweak these values. Um, mainly, you want to, to touch the, the attributes here. Oh, and don't forget to remove the mesh collision if you don't want it to to collide with... Because, um, yeah, it's awesome. It can collide with meshes, but sometimes you don't want it. Uh, as, an, as an example here, you don't want it to collide with the, the wood. Or, uh, well, I'll show you. See the problem? Oh, it's, uh, it's cute, huh? but uh, <laughs> not very useful. Uh, so up, don't forget this, if you want it to burn through the, the wood. Simple tweaks like this and you can obtain something uh, interesting. I won't go deeper, I don't think it's useful here. You just want basic flames. L let's call it the, um, the modern way, okay? Now the old fashioned. For old geezers like me. <laughs> geezers, geezers, uh, I think I say geezers in English. Ah, uh, sorry, I'm French. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, the old way, uh, we needed to, to fake things. So, some people use some lights in the fire. I tend to remove them, or just don't put them in the first place. You can find some really good ones uh, already made in this, you see. It's uh, free for forever, so just go in in a permanently free collection, and you can get this one. You have a lot of uh, beautiful fires, uh, flames everywhere. No problem if you want the the good old ones with uh, probably that will probably use uh, less memory, but you know, maybe we should uh, just just compare. Make sure you. Just do some tests because seriously, the, the fluid sim is improving so fast that uh, I honestly don't know which one is uh, lighter right now. Anyway, if you need to use it, just take fire here. Uh, sometimes they have a light render renderer. I don't want it, so uncheck it or, or delete it. Just keep a basic uh, sprite renderer. You, they may, might have many, but every time you just keep uh, sprite, so it's very light and without light. No, <clears throat> just add a, a point light. Oh, 
uh, another trick if you want the wood to to be lit uh, correctly without shadows just put two lights so yeah i pressed g to show the the lights and uh, because i i hid it wood light is using a different channel use uh, channel one for this wood light and the wood itself you allow the channel one but remove channel zero you don't want the regular light to affect it it's a trick to make sure it's always uh, lit uh, without shadows the normal light uses channel zero as you can see and this one you can ad uh, adjust it to to have a bigger length uh, or bigger source huh, as i did here it's for you, up to you to adapt to your scene and you need to create a good old uh, light function so here you, you create a material a simple material then inside inside this material you select a light function here the, the, the domain is a light function you attribute it to your light here light function you simply select it here or there uh, you can use the volume uh, noise noise sorry that's uh, that is inside the the engine show engine content always check show engine and plugin content basically it's just, you might need it even if it adds some kind of things here uh, you you often need to access the the engine content so now I ask for noise and as you can see we have the 3D ones here. I used the 64. This one I just make it pan uh, in a very uh, basic simple way as you can see. I want it to, to pan very slowly vertically but faster uh, on um, to the left or to the right. It's uh, world-based, so you don't have to worry about uh, UVs or things like that. And then I need to uh, multiply it with a, a this kind of random value based on based on time. It's it makes it uh, flicker, you know. But it creates this. Uh, feeling of a kind of flickering smoke see to recreate this effect that's almost water like see on the real simulation now on here where, where we fake it we try to recreate this feeling so this solution using these two that go uh, against each other, uh, that cross each other, this uh, then make them flicker slowly like this. So very slowly, first scene four, second scene five, and then six. You take the absolute value, you remove the minus, so, then you add all these people then divide but as you can see i cheat i i don't divide by uh by three but only by 2.5 to have a bit more um a bit higher values and i clamp it because i just want it to, to to make it flicker slightly you know i don't want it to, to close uh, to, to shut every anything uh, i want it to go from this value, which is uh, which can go a bit lower some from sometimes to one, and then I even clump it again to make sure uh, I will have something that's see slightly you you barely notice. I just try to reproduce the something more realistic. Of course, you cannot reproduce perfectly, but you can at least give this feeling. Now it's up to you to, to see what you want to use. 
if you're not using Unreal Engine 5 or not feeling comfortable with uh, fluids, now, now you know the other way and uh, after all uh, it seems to be the same cost, uh, at least in this situation. So now you have uh, a choice. <laughs> And uh, hope you will have fun with it. Uh, you can, uh, of course, download it uh, on my Patreon in this uh, this uh, example, this uh, this, pro this project. And please just like and subscribe. And uh, see you soon. I hope. Ciao. Bye bye. Salut.